Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it's Brave's turn to get the important security fixes that rolled out over the last day or so for Google Chrome. And it is expected now that the other Chromium-based web browsers will get more or less the same security fixes. And over and above receiving these important security fixes, Brave has also received a bug fix. Now, first of all, just to look at the fix that's rolled out for an issue regarding the Brave VPN. Apparently, uh, Brave says they fixed the uninstall process that was affecting Brave VPN on Windows. Now, basically, um, what that's all about is that the uninstallation process on Windows was removing the VPN services, even if uh, you canceled the uninstaller. So that bug has been addressed. And because we are dealing with very important security fixes that have rolled out and um, we double check once again that our browser is up to date by heading to our main menu help about brave and the browser version has been bumped up to 1.61.114 and the chromium platform which the browser is based on is exactly the same now as google chrome 120.0.6099.1999 now, just a brief um, recap, if you missed the video I posted on Google Chrome uh, yesterday regarding the security issues that have been addressed. There are six security fixes that have rolled out, and they are all high risk, uh, which means that's your, your level just under critical. So those are important fixes. And we've got common exploits that have been addressed. Uh, use after free in Angle, use after free in Web Audio, and use after free in web gpu which by the way that web gpu could also affect firefox because it has the same component so um, we could expect a security fix to roll out for firefox to address that issue but obviously that's not confirmed but there is a possibility but nonetheless um, there are no zero days or exploits in the wild but because we are dealing with six high risk vulnerabilities that have been patched just to double check your Brave web browsers up to date sooner than later. But I have found that Brave does a very good job of installing updates automatically in the background compared to other browsers. So by now, I'm sure that your Brave web browser would have updated to address those six security issues that have been addressed and that one issue that was affecting the VPN in the Brave web browser. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.